The federal government of Nigeria has pledged to double efforts to combat insecurity, counter-terrorism threats and challenges in the West African sub-region and Nigeria's territorial integrity. President Bala Tinubu assured the 78th Cadet Regular Army, Navy, Air Force and Direct Short Service Course 27 Army and 31 Air Force at the passing out parade and commissioning that the military will embark on a new era of national defense and security strategy without compromising Nigerians' sovereignty. Plus TV News correspondent Habila Darafe report as presented from our studio. The passing out parade of 707 Nigerian Defense Academy cadets, it completed the five years of rigorous training and nine months of direct short service, has reached its peak. The Nigerian President, serving as reviewing officer, attended the first passing out parade honoring the champion battalion Magadishu. The parade began with a slow march and transitioned into a quick march, represented by Vice President Senator Kashim Shetima. The president emphasizes the importance of addressing insurgency and secessionist elements that disrupt peace and economic activities in Africa and Nigeria. Embarking on a new era in our national defense and security strategy, and it will be driven by a resolute commitment to confront the substantial threats and challenges that confront us within the West African region. I have directed all heads of defense and security institutions to unite in their efforts to protect our nation's integrity and well-being. And as chairman of the Air Force, we are diligently working to enhance our regional conflict management and development mechanisms to forge a path towards a greater peace, stability, and progress across West Africa and beyond is to be The nationalist elements disrupting the peace and economic activities of the good people of the Southeast or doubling up our efforts in winning the counter-insurgency in the Northeast and weather in pursuing normalcy in the Northwest. He noted that the globe is quickly advancing in revolutionary technology and that the country will work to raise excellent Iraq men and women rather than just average military defenders to guard our beloved country. In a world characterized by swift advancements and transformative technologies, our mission is clear to strive to nurture not just ordinary defenders but paragons of excellence, both among men and women who serve as vigilant protectors of our cherished nation. We are implementing programs and policies to empower our citizens to combat the challenges of poverty, criminality, and terrorism. From preparing for the food security crisis triggered by the Russian-Ukrainian war, to responding to banditry attacks on farmers, natural road disasters, and the repercussions of military coups. This administration has remained vigilant in devising solutions to mitigate, to mitigate their impact and enhance national security. The president congratulated the new lead graduated conduct for the successful military training, urging them to be worthy ambassadors to defend the nation. Our hope is this spectacular proof that they have received superior training that equips them with a distinct advantage to safeguard the nation's security and advance our collective future. The future of this our great country doesn't only rest upon the battle of these young patriots. If we must take the central stage in protecting our people, this academy must access the support it requires to invest in scientific research and technological innovations and develop prototypes and concepts that align with the federal government's local content policies. Nigeria Defense Academy, established in the year 1964, has graduated 21,140 officers, including 478 from sister African countries since its inception. The academy aims to provide primary military officers training for Nigeria's armed forces, ensuring the number of junior officers and the military increases. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.